All right, what's up, y'all? So now that we've made it through a lot of like the the semantics, if you will, like the the go to the nitty gritty stuff. Uh, what is reach? What is engagement? What is you know? How do I find this? How do I connect it? Now it's time to start letting the rubber meet the road, right? Now we're actually gonna start building stuff. Um, and the first thing that we're gonna do, we're actually gonna go over here to Google, right? You have two options. First option, you have Excel, Microsoft Excel. You also have Google Sheets, right? They're pretty much very, very, I don't wanna say they're the same, they're very similar in how they act, but they do offer different things. Here's some benefits of why I choose Google Sheets. Uh, primarily, if this laptop goes down, I got nothing. It's gone, everything that's on there potentially could be corrupted and gone forever. So having something online through Google is there regardless. Secondly, I can tag multiple people in it. So if myself and Worth, or Worth if we are both working on the same projects together, which a lot of times we are, we share about 10 different clients together. So at any given time, I could be working on some, he'll be working on the other, but we have shared information on all the analytics. Um, and then the other thing too, if you guys, as you're getting started, if you're running into a wall and you need somebody to come in and verify, myself, Worth, or down the road as I have anybody else that's qualified to come in and really just help you with it, all you have to do is share that person with it and they'll have access and they can come in and they can look at your fields um, and then make sure that all the things make sense. So we're gonna go into that in the next topic. We're really gonna dig deeper on what the formulas are, how they make sense, how you can come up with your own in the future even. So with that, this video, I'm gonna walk you through um, this little setup real quick and we're gonna go through and set up your, your Google Sheet. So first and foremost, go to Google. Once you get to Google, you're gonna come up here to the Rubik's Cube, whatever you call it. Um, I have my video in the way right now, so disregard that. Underneath the video is a little triangle that says Drive. You're gonna click that. On Drive, you're gonna come over here to the little plus sign. Click New, go to Google Sheets, click over here to Blank Spreadsheet. And when you do, your spreadsheet's gonna pop up, and now you have access to begin uh, creating your columns. We're gonna do that in the next video, and we're gonna go down that road. So, hope that makes some sense. Definitely reach out uh, if you have any questions, and we'll move on to the next topic.